all right guys so in this video here we're going into backdoor poison team now this is one of our scholars as you know we're in the fastest growing scholarships um they're rocking with a dusk termy 46 speed we got a backdoor shrimp 51 speed with some dull grip and barb and of course on the front vegetable to steal the energy aqua stock and aqua deflect this is to handle your aqua opponents as you know this team is a bit susceptible to aqua opponents so you want to have these just to mix it up and you can put up a ton of shield here now we're going against the traditional backdoor team here pretty scary team got the anti heal here ready for war um so these teams are always hard one of the things one of the situations you gotta always ask yourself is do I want to go through the back or the front, especially when you're using a shrimp team? And against poison teams, all of them are somewhat different. So you really want to look at their cards here to know what they're going to do. So these teams really can't do a ton of damage in the early rounds. Um, they're not going to want to attack your plant, so you don't have to block up as normal, especially in the early round. But by round six or round seven, you're really feeling the combos, you're really feeling all of the poison. So first round round one let's see what options she has and off the gate she doesn't have much options here like you can't get any of your vegetables off vegetables are always great against poison teams you can't go back door you can't do a lot of damage so let's see what you can do here and this is painful this right here basically they got their combo first gives you poop poison 276 down um and interestingly enough they only use two energy so being able to get poison in your first round is absolutely amazing for them so um already we're in a tough pickle here <clears throat> now options that she has here she really doesn't have much i would say i would agree here that probably your best option is getting your vegetable prickling here and one of the things that really hurts on this team is they always have the person that can chomp go for your middle guys this guy has no zero energy so yeah it puts you in a pickle because you have to get rid of an energy to use it again so this turn what she can do here well what she has to do is she probably wants to go shrimp risky risky barb strike and then mystic chomp not even go for the stun just mystic chomp just to make sure that this guy is out of here I think that's what you have to do here, but let's see what she does. She uses one just to get rid of the stun, which also works, I think. And then it's kind of a game of who just used what card. So this guy just used a bunch of cards. He probably doesn't have a bunch of cards here. He's probably pretty vulnerable to an attack. However, this guy, you know, is going to get rid of your term. You probably early. So this is one of those turns round four a lot of people have a lot of cards and you have to be able to anticipate when they're going back door with sticky you that's all you can really do against a team like this keeping this guy alive sometimes is pretty deadly because he can get you with some, some vegetables in the sky so really the poison team the reason why they're always top 2k mmr um they have a lot of choices what i would say to do here and again this is a game that really comes down to getting the right cards to beat this team is you have seven energy you've been patient you've picked your spots you probably have enough to go back door and do some serious damage right you go with the jump risky risky poison then you also go for some mystic here and you do a sticky you for defense i think that's probably your best choice let's see what she does here and she does just that but does she use sticky you here she doesn't so pretty risky move. You need your Terminator to finish this game. Mm. Yeah, this is even just one sticky you would have been what you probably want to do here. And I think that's what really cost her the game. The secret to beating these teams with the Terminator is you need to anticipate the sticky use round four and five. Oh, around three or four one person's gonna have a back door so uh with that being said your terminator can survive one hit from a back door but these two seraphics are doing one three damage yeah. it's gonna take you out by the way we got marin pie in the building maroon pie thank you so much for joining 
Also, Simzeki, what is going on? It's great to have you here. And now it's going to be a tougher game without... It's going to be a super tough game because you don't have the luxury of your Terminator. Also, this guy has no zero cost. So in this move, you have to get rid of this guy here. The only move you can do really is Dull Grip, Prickling, Aqua Deflect. Yikes. And you got to save energy like she's doing. I think this is the right move to do. <laughs> and it's a good night, unfortunately, for the Aqua. Yikes. Okay, so we're in a situation where she does have somewhat of ability to pull this off, but realistically, you're going to have a million poison after these. This guy still survives, so after this poison, it's not going to be all rainbows and sunshines here. But let's see. She saves one energy. And you had to go for that vegetable there. Just had to. And now you're in a situation where you gotta go for big damage. So this is interesting, right? What should she do here? Should she go for two energy, just the prickling aqua deflect? Or does she want to put up a lot of shields? I almost say you have to go for the... 150. Oof. What would you guys do here? Hey, little softy. We're actually looking at your guys, your game here. By the way, a little softly, in our first week, already past the 1,700 MMR. I think that's the record in the flight crew. Absolutely amazing, the progress she's making. So in round seven, this is pretty, this is a pretty hard call, right? What you might want to do is do three cards here. So they still have chomp. So you probably want to do water and can prickling and an aqua deflect. The reason you use three cards, this person's almost done. So with three cards, they'll probably be gone. But let's see what she does. Yep. And she just oof. goes for the vegetable again. <laughs> risky risky going for the vegetable but now you have them in kill range so this person does not have chomp here and i think she pulls this game out so aqua deflect plus prickling i think that's the job done here but can she survive is the million dollar question and i think she does she does so that is one of the big advantages of having an attacking plant here because she needed the plant to do a lot of damage to pull it off. And a lot of people sleep on Aqua Deflect and how much damage it does. 70 damage and 80 shield and a 150 card. It does a great job of pulling the game off. Between Aqua Deflect and Prickling Trap, she was an absolute beast. And this person did not want to wait at any time and save their cards. That's because she had vegetable terrific game here and you can see kind of the things that brought her to being able to beat the poison team well done guys if you like videos like this and you want to see more make sure you hit that follow button and subscribe but for now guys we gotta take off we're gonna keep rocking on twitch but youtube we'll see you next time peace